Go dog, go hit him. I included my audio. Go to Are the party. You go in the party and it will say include my audio. You put the check in the box. Yes. Oh my god. Uh, I don't think so. Oh my god, this cancer needs to stop. It's time to stop. <sighs> don't worry. Did I just banned a bunch of it? trolls. I, I literally just banned a bunch of trolls yeah. from my page. <laughs> no, actually, no, that's the first time I banned somebody from the page in like almost a whole year. <laughs> I didn't even, I didn't even know who ran that. That was me. Yeah, that that page used to be more legit than the hub. Well, it's because Z4 Bros. like literally used Dividable Halo to get his stuff more popular. Yeah. That's all I Did reason. everyone include their audio? Does it tell you who includes it and who doesn't? Yeah. No. But if once they include it, I'll be able to pick it up during the stream. No, he's not involved. Oh shit, it's Osman. It's Osman. <laughs> yeah, he may want to be careful about that one. Alright, my phone's dead, so somebody else is gonna have to message Dom. Alright. <laughs> call him, where is he? Nah, he was just on like uh, 20 minutes ago when it was his party. Yo, whoever's being triggered, stop. <sighs> oh my god, I'm so tired. Who's this? It's one of my guys. Oh. Don't worry, I didn't invite anyone. Husband's only here to make sure that everything no, gets just addressed hit recording record stuff. <laughs> He's like, well, what do you expect? <sighs> Dog, go to bed. You gotta go get your stitches removed later. In a couple hours, I'll be able to buy Overwatch. <sighs> Message him on Facebook and spam him. That's all you gotta do. He was literally just on. Uh huh. All you gotta do is spam him, and eventually he'll get the message. I don't understand why he appears offline. So people won't bother him. I appear offline a lot. We can't start it without them. Yeah, we can.
<sighs> Boy. I mean, we can start without him considering that you guys are going to be recording this and he can just watch it once it's yeah, on YouTube. Yeah. I was right through here. There you go. In before party bomb. Frank, can you not have everybody from your clan join? That'd be beautiful. I'm not. You know, I'm not. I just turned my alarm. I don't know. I don't know. too, simply to make sure that everything's being held right. Osmond runs Oni. She has to be here. She runs my Oni, yes. Because <laughs> it's classified. You need to get a mic. Hashtag section zero. She needs to get herself a mic again. Stepdaughter broke it. I need to get myself some Spartan files. Those are classified. You know? Yeah, those are uh, extremely classified. Oh. I'll just they have to buy existed. them off the black market then. Uh, the black market doesn't even have them, I'm sorry. Oh, you see my files back then, you know, what happened was, is when the Pelican was flying off reach, the, you know, the Pelican got shot down, and the files were on that Pelican, so they got burned in mm. that Pelican. So my files oh. were lost in the Battle of Reach, pretty much. <laughs> That's a good story. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> well, no, post your face when a wild Osmond's in the game. Oh. I didn't actually expect her to get on. I, I told her that there was a meeting tonight, and she's like, uh, I may make it, I may not. Aww. The poor doogie. Oh, I've lost connection. Fuck. All you have to do is send me we, another invite. If uh, that's the case, then all you have to do is quit out your Halo 5 and restart it. And then you should be able to get in. Uh, I gotta do something really quickly. I'm trying to get my dog out of my room. Go. Get dog. Go. Get. Get. Get doogie. Get. Go lay down. Go, go lay down. I understand you just had surgery and everything. Go back, go lay down. <clears throat> Alright, I'm back. There we are. Oh, Ferry. Yes. You, did you know that Fido from SOH is in uh, Vast now? He's not in SOH. No, no, I didn't. He wasn't in uh, Vast anymore last I checked. What, Vast? He yeah, wasn't in Vast last I checked. I saw him on the roster, unless the like, the roster's wrong. Well, like, we posted in one of the groups that uh, a couple days ago that uh, that he was there till recently. <sighs> so. Okay. So who's um King Vexation? He's with me. I mean. Shadow Director, are you joining the game? He has to quit I just joined. Yeah, okay. Know. There we go. Zegu, you can start staring at me and go inside the meeting room. <laughs> so we're being childish already, I see. <laughs> you're already starting it. It's not even started yet, and you're already starting. Come on, Fred, man. chill. Dude, I'm not doing anything. Fahim. He's just looking at me. Fahim, chill. Well, he's looking All at of you, you. Chill. It doesn't matter, does it? All he had to do was go in the meeting room. It's not hard to do. Nobody's here to assassinate. None of that. It's just security. Well, you know. I think I've been on this map. Yeah, I know this map.
Mm-hmm. Yes. Well, yeah, I suppose I'll go first, considering director's mic has been a bit funny lately. Um, so, what is your current stance, well, what is your guys' current stance on OOE then? I don't exactly know it. So, what are your current rules of engagement then? Kurt, you can pull that up from a... Uh... That uh, kick chat. Oh, my uh, phone crashed, so I don't have the uh, kick chat. So, like, I have it, but I don't have it past a certain date. I have the one director sent me. But I don't know if it's updated or not. I have it on my tablet, my tablet is there at the moment. Alright, so am I reading the ROE or is someone else reading it? Yeah, yeah, you're reading it. Alright, so it says here the defense ROE is tier 1 weapons unlimited, tier 2 weapons 3, uh, tier 3 weapons 2, 1 sniper, 1 rocket launcher, 1 heavy vehicle regular, and that's something I wanted to talk about. When you mean regular, do you mean the standard hog? Or yeah. what, exactly? Because we all use all base corp hogs. No. No core warthogs, no tundra, no woodland, none of that stuff. Just the basic default vehicles that you get. Why is that? I mean, there's no difference in the. Yes, they the are. Standard. It's strength wise, it's armor. It's stronger. Then you stand. Oh, the armor is okay. stronger. Yeah. So yes. would that be a problem if we gave you woodland hogs? I mean, if it's for the opposite team, I mean, I guess that's fine, but. Because we're on so on really the base I've choice. done, you've got um you've got a woodland hog, in a supply crate you've got a rally hog, and in our base we've just got standard corp hogs, no gas turrets or anything. I mean that's fine. I don't really see yeah, any, I mean I believe. That. Yeah, on our meeting map we've got a tundra, scorpion, but that's a meeting map, so I don't know if it counts for meeting maps. I assume no, it doesn't. Yeah, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, no. that's fine then. Okay. Give me a second. Okay, it says no Goss Hog or Torrent. One modded vehicle, so... Can you go off that? Like, what do you mean by one modded? As in just one wreck, I presume? It's transport. It's not... It's not a combat vehicle. Because it says here, no ghost hog or tyrant, one modded vehicle, transport, non-combat, no visibility check. It means a scout There's hog. no bracket there, so... Okay. Yeah, it's a transport uh, vehicle. Now, this is something I, I personally innovation. did not understand here. It says no heave vehicle. What is that? Heavy. No what vehicle? I think it means heavy. No heave vehicle. Is that heavy? Is that supposed to say heavy? Because it says on my well, thing, no heave. it must have got cut off. Yeah. Okay, so what would you classify as a heavy vehicle? Just like tanks and shit. Tanks, mantis. Uh, Why is that cut out of the um, equation? Is there a, an a answer for that, or is that just wait? What is it? Say? Silent? It says here no. Why are there no heavy vehicles? Yeah, like why are there no and heavy that's for vehicles a defense? exactly? Yeah. I don't remember us saying that you couldn't use a tank at all. Well, I think, I, I, what, uh, is that I, think what was, I think something was misinterpreted during all that. Like somebody was meant to put like well, like no more than one. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I remember. On the base we've got, we've got one tank, but it's stationary and it's a tundra, so it cannot move, and it's got quite the blind spot so I don't know what you, your guys opinion is on that the uh, the no he vehicle basically that what it means to say is no heavy vehicles leaving the base so if you have a scorpion it needs to stay in the base at all times yeah it's stationary it can't move it's stuck ground yeah. it can't move Same as he said it's a tundra so is it destroyable 
Oh yeah, it's it's stationary, but as I said, it is a tundra because the How base is this? white. So all right, listen. How about this? Let's from start <clears throat> one. Let's say uh, standard vehicles, so no requisition vehicles. One scorpion on each base, so like one scorpion on a base. One, a couple of turret warthogs, like two turret warthogs. Um, a couple of, or a few transport warthogs, which is three. Um, what else? Mongoose and, I don't know, three mongooses. And uh, two wasps. No, one wasp. No, one wasp. No Phaeton. No Phaetons, no, just wasp. A uh, human view. This is this all things that can be up at the same time? I suppose so. I mean, there's not going to be enough to deal with. I suppose. Hmm. I'm just trying to think. Yes, that could be up all at the same time. Well, honestly, with the wasp, I would honestly say it would be silly if the wasp couldn't leave the base. Yeah, the wasp can leave the base. Yes, though. It's just not the scorpion. But it can't, it it can't, can't spawn leave kill. the base entirely. I would say sp like it can't go on the, the base. Yeah. Okay, so vehicles... I think um, warthogs should be allowed to, like, leave the entrance of the base. Not by far, but... Just go out the front a little bit, and no goss yeah. hogs, um, rocket hogs, just turret hogs. Okay. Yep. Um, okay. No killing within five seconds away from spawn. So I suggest so everyone says... is writing this down then. Uh, no spawn killing from base with any weapon. No spawn killing with power weapons. Mm -hmm. Which is pretty much the same thing. And no yeah, spawn killing with vehicles. And then it says, well, that's pretty much the defense RE. Then it says attack RE is reckless out. So I presume it's AR nade, Magnum. AR pistol. Um, and no lockdown base. Now, what I didn't understand is this. I just wanted to clarify this now. Is so this is for the attackers. So I'm. Correct me if I'm wrong here, so when you're defending, let's just say that we lose the base and you're defending the base, that defense RE we have, does that apply to you as well? Yep. Okay, that's just fine. Alright then. Oh, with the um, Nikon and spawn at all, does that mean that if we are, like, let's say the attackers kill, like, let's say I'm attacking Shadow Drifter's base and I kill one of your guys, I can't shoot your guy in the spawn with an assault rifle, or...? You can hold him down at spawn, but I, want, yeah, okay. I would say it would be a bit ridiculous if you literally station someone at spawn, just, like, mainly there to spawn kill him continuously. Because then it's just silly. Honestly. So, like, I'd say that's fine, as long as you're moving forward, if that makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, another thing I wanted to add in, no Halo 1 pistols. No, I don't think there should be any requisition, um, weapons at all. Because on our base we've got, like, ARs and BRs, that's it. No, because no, certain we'll be ones will do more damage. No, we've got just got ones with the, uh, target finder in it. Hey, Kurt, That's are you it. taking notes on this, or is anyone? I'm recording it. I'm taking. I notes mean, what? On it. What we'll do then is for our bases is every base that is you know we're going to be going up against. I don't know if you guys would agree, but what we what we can do is the clan that we're going to be facing. So let's say myself v versus Fred be the first raid, for example. Um, I'll take Fred on my map on Forge. And show him everything there is to the base. Yep, I agree with that. So then everything's shown. I don't know if you want to be completely fair and say, okay, well, this is a weak point in the base and whatnot, or leave that to discover for the people themselves. I mean, I have no problem with doing that. Yeah, I'll show you my maps before uh, each game. That's what I already do with each clan that I do raids against. Okay, that's fine then, so I'll do the same. Currently, we've only got one base built, and um, I have a 
feeling you guys are gonna not like it. So huh. I'll have to show Does right it after have the game. Bridges? No, definitely not. No, it's like um. Is there an entrance just... in the base at all times? Uh, yeah, it is. You open the first door, but the um how it works, That's it's a like a flood gate. Base. Now unless the ba it's... now unless the door is the shield door that you can easily destroy. But a like lockdown base would be like what a filthy child has on the pillar, his version of the pillar autumn, which might I add, he's lost multiple times to multiple different clans. I mean, where there's one door that literally shuts down and it that it, it blocks you off from getting in the base. It's multiple the doors. Is... Yeah. No, with our one, it's like the back door will close, but the front door opening to the actual base will then open. Can all doors open though at the same time? I mean, like, uh, no. each one can open. It's like a floodgate, so, but the, how it works is that alarm will go off when the door is opened, which will alert the people inside that you're in the base. Um, to shut it, I'll have to show you how to turn it off. Um, the, obviously, we do have requisitions on the map, so I'll have to update it and take them off if we're not doing that. Um, I believe at spawn, you guys are given Tundra Hogs, I believe. Might be mistaken. I gotta go update Pillar after this a little bit. Um, apart from that, we still have bases underway. Like we've only got one finished, and I have a feeling you'll have an issue with it. So I don't know how that's gonna work if that is. The What's the case. issue with that? Like, what do you think? Is we'll have there's, is there's like something I've requested to get changed myself, but it's like a crane. So it's like a in, I think it's an infantry platform where you gotta stand with a bunch of crates surrounding you where when you're up there the problem is you're exposed all sides so you've got a thruster into whatever direction you want to go and then clamber in but that's counterable as the people that you'll have stationed behind the rocks can just nade the top of the platform which will kill anyone at the top if you do the nades properly I'm presuming you're Spartans you should have no problem with doing that with doing so, sorry. You can just show me. I don't know. As I said, I'll show you. Look, I feel that we're moving a bit too fast and no one's really able to record what we're doing besides the, you know, the capture device. So I'm going through, and these are the only rules that we've actually established to my mind. So number one, no gorse hogs, no rocket hogs, no requisition vehicles, only two turret hogs, only three mongooses, one scorpion and one wasp. Applies to attackers and defenders. Is everyone agreeing on that? Mm. I agree to that, and I wanted to add in something um, I would personally like to say. If there was like an agreement in a raid where you guys had something that you wanted to put on as a one-off and then you give us something in return for you changing, if that makes sense, for that one raid, if if you guys want to do that. No, I think, no, I think this should just apply to everyone and nothing changes. Okay, well, um, as you've seen our bases, there's like a lot we've got to change in our bases then, because our bases are based around yeah. wrecks, aren't they? Well, yeah, just change the... Weapons, it'll be easy, don't worry. Take 10 minutes. I gotta do okay. the same as well. So, does everyone on the opposition agree or not? Hello? I agree. It, it's I agree. acceptable. Okay. Yeah. okay. Brilliant then. Um, now, right. I think we'll move on to our weapon rules. So, um, obviously we'll start off, I don't want to see any requisitions because I feel that it can get a little bit too full on, so it, any requisition weapon, just take it out. Okay, you guys okay. agree on that. Okay, I have a question about that, like if we were to put silencers on weapons, like magnums with silencers, things like that, is that acceptable? No, no, no re nothing to do with requisitions, just our complete ODSTs standard weapons. are primarily based around using the silenced weapons. Mm. I, I kind of like the aesthetic still... wrecks that are kind of harmless. I don't see. It doesn't. Too much it actually well, makes I, feel, I feel just to keep everything. I feel just to keep everything simple, balanced, fair to everyone. Because the silencers, if you're crouching, you can shoot, and you're off radar. And well, you're off radar even if you stand up. And with the silencers, even if you stand up, you're off well, radar. Well, when you. Yeah. But, and on okay, all my yeah, game so types. 
In all my game tapes, I have radar off, so... That, that's just something that I've always done. Well, uh, well that's going to be another thing we're going to talk about. Do you guys have vis visibility check off? <laughs> what do you mean? Alright. Where you kill someone and stare and spawn until they leave? Yeah. Is that... Hold on. So, is that an actual feature? Yes. Yes. Yeah. So, so, are you talking about how when someone's at a spawn, so say I'm standing at a spawn and say Fred is dead, and if I don't leave, he can't spawn. Can you yeah. actually turn that setting off? Yes. It's oh, yeah, we'll turn settings. that setting off, yeah. It's under general yeah, yeah, settings. We'll, we'll, yeah. yeah, we'll, we'll okay, uh, make um, sure that you can spawn straight after you Something die. else that's like, a seconds. bit off topic, but is a bit of a concern. Surprise raids, is that going to be a thing as well? God only knows. Depends if you guys leave your games on open. Well, because no, we don't usually. And all our guys are doing raid training, as I've already spoken to your, you, sorry, and Kurt already. About time restrictions About if you things. If you guys don't want surprise raids to be a thing, we don't have to do them. Yeah, I mean, I had a feeling that you guys um, would going to attempt on doing some form of infiltration which we have no issue if with you doing but I'll just state this now if you want the activity to last then you'll play it f you know fairly of course but if you want to play it dirty by all means but of course you know the activity is not going to last if you do it if you do things like that yeah mm -hmm. I'm not doing stuff like that Osmond all right I'll take your word for it that Osmond's already stated that she doesn't have any only assets in your clan so I talked to her okay, earlier today about it. I mean, I'm more than happy to share any intel that's public, of course. Like, if you just want to know something, just ask. You know? Simple as. Right. So, I guess we've got everything like that covered. Unless we, we haven't, haven't yet. Very... We have, we have quite a lot to good. still discuss. Otherwise... Mm -hmm. Everyone's going to be put to a disadvantage. So I'm rec I'm writing down the rules for weapons. Um, so I'm saying no wreck weapons. One rocket launcher, one Spartan laser, one rail gun. Um, I reckon three battle rifles. Wait, only three battle rifles can be up at a time? Yeah. Yeah. Three battle rifles. Um. Uh. Two DMRs. No, no, three battle. Uh, three DMRs. Three DMRs. Um. And I assume you can dub these, right? Sorry? As in, like, if I was holding a railgun, I can pick up a DMR. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. You can double these, yes. But you can't double, like, you can't double the power, weapons power weapons such as... Yeah. You can't dual power weapons such as rocket launcher with a Spartan laser or, you know, with railguns. It can only be DMRs with, uh, you know, stuff like that. Uh, three DMRs... Um... However many unlimited uh, uh, magnums. Mm. Um, unlimited assault rifles. A. Put that down. Uh, four. What is it? Four SMGs. Okay, so I've currently got no wreck weapons, one rocket launcher, one spark laser, one railgun, three battle rifles, three DMRs, unlimited magnums, unlimited assault rifles, four submachine guns. Am I missing any weapons that you guys would like to throw Go in? back over that again. No wreck weapons. One rocket launcher. One Spartan laser. 
one railgun, three battle rifles, three DMRs, unlimited magnums, unlimited assault rifles, four submachine guns. Saw, shotgun, hydra. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, I reckon... And I presume everything else you cannot use. One, no, nah, yeah, yeah. Um, here, hold on, I'll get to that. So one hydra. Uh, one saw. How many shotguns? Like two? Mm, yeah, two. And. Hold on. Two. What? You cut out? I'm here. Yeah, alright, so. All right. Uh, two shotguns. And. Those are the only weapons. You said four yeah. SMGs? Yeah, I'll go over it all in a sec. Permitted. Alright, bye bye. No wreck weapons, one rocket launcher, one Spartan laser, one railgun, three battle rifles, three DMRs, unlimited magnums, unlimited assault rifles, four submachine guns, one hydra, one sword, two shotguns, and those are the only weapons permitted. What about Covenant or Forerunner? No, nah, those yeah, are the only weapons permitted. Other clans, yeah. Man. No, no, no. That's all that's permitted and that's it. If. Okay. Uh, this is just to keep things for, fair for you and us because we don't want to have any bullshit. If we see um, anything over that or any other weapons besides that on the base, it's an instant raid win to the team that is, um, you know, not in the wrong, obviously. All right, do you guys agree with that or not? I'd say personally that's a bit extreme. I'd say just leave them on the base, but don't use them. Well, consider yeah. no, considering that you get He's to go through the base user. with one another. Considering you get to go to the base, go through the base with one another at, before it even starts. I think that if you have these weapons on your base before a raid, then it's your own fault that you lost. I mean. Yeah, but I would say that's a bit extreme starting the game off and then because there may be like a pistol like that Let's just say that was forgotten to be deleted Instant raid win that's just retarded. I'd just say leave it so if it's used Because yeah, what said, if it's a weapon there's bases that we've got some... What if it was a weapon? Well, if they so use someone it, if they got overran Well, they can oh, use yeah, it then well, if they if they use yeah. it will claim the win. Okay, then that's not right, fair enough. All right Fine, well you guys understand how it is. That rule will be So it's just an instant raid when if they use the weapon, no warrants or anything, just instant? Yeah, instant. If you used a weapon that you... I mean, if you pick it up accidentally and you quickly trade it out, that's fine. As yeah, long as, as you're long not as shooting you don't anyone, kill someone with it. As long as you're not shooting anyone, killing someone with it, don't give a shit. You said yeah. uh, no gas hogs. What about uh, I mean no gas turrets or gas hogs? What about uh, rocket turrets and rocket hogs? Are those yeah, all? Yeah, I mean, these we are said, your rules. I mean, these are, we these said are no, your rules. It's not ours. We're agreeing on uh, no. So what we've agreed on for vehicles is no gas hogs, no rocket hogs, no wreck vehicles. Only two turret hogs. Only three mongooses. One scorpion and one wasp, and those are the only vehicles permitted to each team. So no mantis. Fly suit attack. No mantis. No. Okay. Does that count for stationary ones? No. Oh yeah. If they're stationary and not being used, then that's fine. Okay. Does everyone agree on the uh, rules so far? Because that's not everything. Mhm. Mm yeah. Yeah, it's pretty decent. Okay, cool. Sure. Um, number three, so we'll start. Ready. Now, so we've gotten the vehicles and the weapons out of the way. Now, what topic should we move on for the third? If Raid you're dicks. Writing down... Oh, okay. Okay. Well, unless Raid there's dates? something else you want to discuss. I think raid dates aren't really a rule. I think we're trying to get ROE and rules yeah. out of the way before we establish dates. Okay, 
There yeah. must be an entrance in the base. Like, there's no door no hidden like entrance from both is. sides. No, you can't have a... You know, straightforward. You can't have a door in anywhere in your base that has a button on only one side. Right. I agree. I agree. Well, like with our pillar map, we have uh, only the armory has a button. We deleted all the other buttons. So I'm going to explain how we got the pillar briefly. A filthy child lost it, and then we went in and recovered it from another clan. And we've been using it since. I don't understand how he lost it, but he lost yeah. it. And only the armory door okay. has a thing in that's uh, accessible you open it by the both bridge. Sides? Yeah, it could be only the oh, bridge okay. can be accessed. It can access. Oh, it, okay. so. yeah, I know what you're talking about. I've been on there. Okay, so what I'm basically establishing from this is that all doors must be able to open from both sides. Yes. Sound good? Ah, uh, brilliant. Yeah. I'm writing that one down. Basically, no teleporters that lead you to instant death or anything like that, or trap you in a room for the whole entire raid. No gas yeah, chambers. Yeah, uh, I'll, I'll write that okay. in. Okay, okay. We'll, um, we'll, no um, gas chambers. In. That is somebody's <laughs> oh, notorious for that in here. All doors must be me. able to be open from both sides. Uh, Don't worry. Okay, so for this, I'm kind of establishing base rules now. So all doors must be able to be open from both sides. What else then? No teleporters say? that lead you into a room where you're stuck. Would you okay. guys want to say, like, kind of... No, no teleporters that no lead to based. a... Yeah, no team. Well, that's that, uh, that's common knowledge. But then again, this is 2016 and the we'll community is full of retards. Well, you yeah. kind of just... Just to be technical there. Yeah, because, no I, I mean, we, we've all seen Rasha the Dark in her autism. No team-based... Uh, Ray, oh, almost any some of her autism. <laughs> okay, all right. So we got all doors must be opened from must be able to be opened from both sides. No team based raids, and the score limits, uh, what... the time limits. You know. Server. Oh yeah, yeah. We'll... Yeah, server cycle we'll quickly... is what it's called server. now. But yeah. Okay, hold on. What what did you guys say? So we said no teleporters that lead to an ultimate death or being stuck. Yeah, yeah I remember the white van Infinite. from Reach Strike. Okay. No gas chambers, <laughs> jail cells. Oh. Like gas chambers, I don't see anyone. Oh. No, not in a raid. <laughs> Must. Not. Lead. Uh, so so basically no traps of any sort, right? Like mm -hmm. can't even have yep. like a little one where trips your Spartan. No. <laughs> Ultimate. I, I'm gonna, oh, wow. I have lightning strikes throughout my some of my map, some of my maps, oh. but that's beyond the point. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, like so... what about visual things like that? Aesthetics like and things like that I can kill. I'm cool with that. Pillar snow map. Snowstorm. I don't Snow give a shit about weather, uh, weather effects. So oh my god. That one didn't oh, be you're those, in like, for... Weather effects aren't even a rule. <laughs> oh, they're gonna pillar. abuse that thing. <laughs> you're, gonna, you're gonna regret that one. Because I got a version of my pillar. Okay, you know what? Then I'm changing. Oh my gosh, yeah, you'll <laughs> well, considering have like two considering... feet visibility. Oh, no, yeah, you can't even see a foot in front of you. You like, have to wait until the enemy gets like right up in your face to kill him. Oh my gosh. All doors must Never be able to be open from side. I mean, it sounds no, kind of fun, but I've oh, never cancer. done that before. We did a six hour oh. raid on it, and it just kept feeling like it just get just kept getting thicker and thicker every hour. God. <laughs> the wall is bad as it goes through the walls of the base, too, and it just you can't, you can't see anything. Okay, so what that. I've got, teleporters must lead to, yeah. must not lead to an ultimate death or one-way trip. No traps allowed. Visibility must be there. Um, <laughs> yeah, it must be at least you can see like a hundred feet in front of you, at least. Yeah, <laughs> something like that. A strike, I'll strike. I'll, I'll, I'll personally show you the map that they're talking about. <laughs> like. What about strobe lights or any kind of spot? Okay, none of that because I know that there's way. people that are epileptic in the community. So, I, I mean, unless you want to go to jail for murder, <laughs> unintentional murder. Yeah, yeah, let's. 
Let's try not. I'd to rather not have seizures. Right, you know, six hours that going six on. Six hours of fucking anyway. strobe lights in your face. Yeah, no, thanks. Not at all. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you. I'm going to bed. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what is going on in chat right now? But I mean, that's like a vast majority of the rules right there. <sighs> We'll just establish some ground. All right. So what I've got for base rules so far: all doors must be able to be opened from both sides. No team-based raids. All teleporters must not lead to an ultimate death or one-way trip. No traps allowed. You must use weather effects that permit you to see 100 meters in front at least. Uh, what about? Did we cover like bridge, br uh, bridge maps? Bridge maps. And, uh... Yeah, because oh, that, bridge maps. Some clans. Not, yeah. Oh, I know some clans that. are notorious for that <clears throat> rapture in his clan. Russian. No so, bridge maps. No bridges that like are not, over. Like, what about the aesthetic no, no. bridges? Like, that no, are actually, like, really no, no, short? No, no. Shut up. Yeah, I will make a rule. No bridges like, like, that require two seconds or more to walk over. I don't know. Something like that? Something okay, simple yeah, about something it, yeah. Like that. Yeah. No bridges. That. <laughs> Why? Wow. No darkness echoes bird was in somebody's house? Yeah. <laughs> oh, Strike, I was told to tell you leave the birdie alone. Oh boy. <laughs> no, I think somebody else has a bird. I don't know. I, know. I, think I, I, I was told bird. next time I no. see you to tell you to leave the birdie alone. Alright. <laughs> okay, so no bridges that require you to walk more than two meters, uh, two seconds over it. Yeah, two seconds. All right. That's, that's acceptable. Yep. Okay, that's great. Because when you're sprinting, it should only take you, a, like, not even a second to get over it. Um, right. But bridges that are inside bases, that's fine, as long as they don't lead to any stupid locations like we said, like, no traps and, you know... It's fine as long as it it follows the rules. Um, what about so like basically catwalks? everything. Uh, right, how long left. are they? Like, I don't know. I just thought that could technically be an indoor. <clears> I mean, as something. long as it's not something where we right. can't get over, and you know, okay. if it's something that we can get over, then and we don't have to worry about being killed every single time. Basically, as long as it follows the rules that we've put here, then it doesn't matter. Because these rules, like, it's going to be like Navcom. Like, I mean, if you break on rules, it's kind of like, go fuck yourself kind of thing. Yeah. And... So what about, like, if you start out, let's say, on, like, an island, and you have to go to, like, a ship or something? Should no hidden teleporters. Like no hidden teleporters. You have to have like some sort of scripted boat or a bridge to a it. A scripted boat. Okay. All right. The okay. boat has no to have cover though. Because <laughs> that's just gonna All be right, a just check. pick okay. off. So I think, I think that we've got the the you know a good amount of uh, basic oh, rules here. <laughs> what the but, fuck um, is that? I have no idea. What I'm thinking, <laughs> what I'm thinking now, is we move to the game types. Oh, wait, did you write down the visib the visibility check thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That you have to be able to see more than 100, at least 100. No, I'm talking uh, about uh, on the game the visibility type where you check. Can stare and spawn. Like if you stare oh, and spawn you mean that. with the visibility yeah. check. Oh yeah, yeah. We'll write that. Yeah, that we'll has write, to be. We'll, considering we're moving on to the uh, game mode part, we'll write that one yeah. down then. Okay, so number four. Uh... Okay, so visibility check. So what is it? On or off? Off. What do you guys want it? Uh, off, okay. Is e that way we don't have to worry about, you know, people just staring into the spawn and just holding us there for six hours. <clears throat> Another right. thing that I've seen Rapture do. And off. I mean, do you take us to be that cancerous? No, no, no. I, I'm just stating, you know, I've, this is things I've seen people do to try and get wins. Uh, yeah, visibility we'll check must be turned. Cancer. Visibility yeah, check must be turned off for every raid. I'll get into mine. 
every raid. Yep. Alright. Uh, um, what else? Uh, okay, now spawn weapons. Spawning weapons. I believe that for spawning just weapons, weapons, we should all start. AR man, yeah, man, right. start with wreck weapon. No, we start off with just a standard assault rifle and a magnum. Yep. AR yeah, magnum right and right two grenades, right. two frags, or just two frags. Yeah. Nah, two frags is good. One. I think that's fine. Yeah, that's yeah, fine. Yeah, two frags. Uh, now, um, radar off. No, I mean that, that gives everybody no, attack, that, that gives on. you a tactical advantage on attack. If like, let's say we take the base from you, and then it gives you the same advantage that we had. We'll try to take it back over. Because mm. all my game types, Hold we on. keep radar off. It's just we, yeah, we do not like radar. Mine. I hate radar with a passion. Because the Halo Five radar is. Busted a little, so we just said get rid of it. Oh, I don't know. Um, I mean, I guess no radar kind of works. It's just I don't mind if there's a radar or not. I mean, I mean, I just, okay. it's just kind of. I'm trying to. Think. I'm just trying to think. Um. No radar. Yeah, you did have a good point. Director, what do you think? I don't know. Um, I mean, if you're you fine with that, I'm fine with that. I don't, I don't fucking agree with it, but I mean, if you're fine with it, then I'll go if along with it. If you want to, well, fucking, you're a part of the meeting as well. If you disagree, then say well, you no, disagree. Well, no, it's not like why. a big thing, is it? It's not a big thing. No, it is. Mm. So if you just train on, without like, radar and... Get used yeah, to exactly. Radar. Yes. Yeah, just so, play, just yeah. teach your guys to listen to the sounds of the map, and get used to it. Yeah, yeah, that, that's what my that's guys do. Alright, fine. That's what my guys do. Alright, that's, that's fair. Alright, well, um, radar must be turned off on every map. Alright. Oh, nah. Nah. so radar is turned off for every map. Is there a uh, select numbers you need to win the war, or is it just whoever kills each other off first? Just until the Sorry, what? clans want to just... get out of the war. So I yeah. think. Are you bringing? I think it should be alliance? a particular amount. I think it should be a particular amount. Oh shit! This is a hard one. Well, hold on. Before yeah, we move to that part, is that everything we agree on for the maps? Would you like me to read out the map rules? Like the uh, game mode rules, I mean? Yeah, refresh everyone. Yeah. Please. Make sure to add okay. no score limits and time limits because I know. Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Yeah. Uh, visible oh, that's okay. Must I've be seen people off. accidentally leave it on. Yeah. yeah, I hate the grenades. Visibility check must be turned off for every raid. Starting weapons must be standard assault rifle and magnum with two grenades. Or yeah. frag grenades. Um, radar must be turned off for every map. And what else would, should we do? Um, scoreboard score is turned off. Or is... Off and timer is turned off unless otherwise discussed before, unless we agree on a time beforehand. Is that yeah. fair? Yeah, that's fair. Alright. Okay, brilliant. So I think that are all the rules, unless anyone else here wants to add more into the uh, game mode rules. So I'll go over them one more time since we've got everything. Visibility check must be turned off for every raid. Starting weapons must be standard assault rifle and magnum with two frag grenades. Radar must be turned off for every map. Score is turned off and timer is turned off unless we agree on a time beforehand. And I should add in... Um, Unlimited ammo. 
unless you guys want to disagree to limited ammo and put in mm, a limited I mean, amount. I was planning on here. developing maps that really don't really support that, but I mean... I mean, I wouldn't do that. I mean, because you've got ammo crates, so... I don't think... Yeah, as long as you have ammo good. crates on the map, I suppose it'd be fine with limited ammo. I mean, if okay, you have so we'll then someone quit... Yeah, I'm not quit. If someone lags out and then they get invited back, they're gonna have frag grenades, and they're gonna have, uh... Yeah, I don't... I'll just keep it the same, like, if it's just a standard. So are we doing... My are we just doing standard mag size then? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. And I'm just kind of curious, how does ROE cover if you like lag out or somebody DOSs you? Or is that not covered? Well, nobody's gonna be. ROE. Nobody should be doing mm. that in here. Because, well, I mean, I'm if someone lags people, out, this is different. People are well, snoopy. Yeah. Cough, cough, you. Hey, listen here. Okay. <laughs> now. I'm just saying, like. No, no, no. Just like. Like, I don't know how that would be right. implemented into the So, ROE, who here uses K has ever used K and Enable? I'm pretty sure everybody has. Everyone here has used K and Enable? So, no, you know when you're using so. it, right? And you see people, like, you can see how many packets are being sent out from a certain mm -hmm. IP address. I'm going to have yeah. Kane Enable open on every single game we have involved with one another. Okay? And if there's a specific amount of um, packet, like a high amount of packets coming from an IP address, you, you will, the, the, the raid will end straight away. Okay. And we'll, we'll reschedule it for another time. It won't be a raid with to either team. It will just be tied and we will reschedule it because, you know, we don't want to have any stupid stuff going on. Everyone agree or not? Yeah, I agree yep. not. Yeah, just as a precaution. Yeah. I mean, even you guys can have Kane and Abel open to watch it. Yeah. Well, the only way that... Uh, yeah. Well, with the dedicated servers, you'd have to be in a party with somebody. Really? Yeah. With really? the ded okay. Halo dedicated servers, the only way to pull an IP address is to be inside of a party with them. I never knew that. Um, mm, I swear, so they... I think there's, honestly, I think I've actually been able to pull an IP without it. I mean, we'll try it out later on. Right now, that's what we'll go off Like, the only now, games that I've ever, that I've, I've been able it. to pull IPs from, that are, if I'm not in a party with somebody, and pull IPs from, is, like, Battlefield... Games without dedicated servers. Right. Huh. Um, That's the only place I've been Have you there. used Can Enable on Xbox One yet? I'm yeah, sure. and yeah. that's yeah, that's how I know that you can't do it with the dedicated servers. Yeah. That you'd have to be in a party with somebody. Okay. Well, for now we'll agree on that. But if anyone kind of considering your history, not to be biased, but some people in the uh, in our clans would be like, oh. Kurt's a prick, he will DDoS us. Mm. It's like, yeah. well... Yeah, well, little did, uh, they tell, little did they forget to mention is that normally they'd make a threat to hit me offline first and then they'd go offline because of it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, okay, we'll, we'll just say, you know, packets will be monitored and if they can't be, well then, fair enough, we won't worry about it. But um, right. if someone lags out... Mm -hmm. Now, do we just want to just set, you know, the normal rule where, oh, fuck you, I'm going to invite one of my members, or do you guys want to just leave that spot open and let your member join back in, or one I of yours? I can invite one of mine. I mean, it should be a free do for all. If somebody to... lags out, it's fair game. I wouldn't expect you guys to leave a spot for me. If I lagged out, I'd expect you one... guys to try and do what you can to win. It, it's fair It's fair game at that point. It's an open slot, both sides. I see. I suppose. The only thing I see, if, if you're trying to raid, like, a party of people, you don't want just randoms coming in, or... Yeah, I giving... think, like, with all this, the game should be left on invite only, so... Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. Unwanted clans right. don't try to party bomb, and if they do, then we should agree to just help each other wipe that one clan out. And that yeah. decides... Yeah, a, a, a temporary ceasefire. 
to reach yeah, out. Yeah, on so. one another, yeah. That's cool. All right, then that's fine. So we'll agree. Um, so f we'll just say free for all invites when, like, only to people who are in the coalition, though. Right. Invites. So who's all backing SOS? Sentry dude uh, and commando. So far? Yeah. In the I'm debating whether or not it should be an asshole um, tonight. I invite the members that are in the call. Okay, so we've got, so I'll go over the game rules one more time just so we're all clear on it. I don't want anyone to be put at a disadvantage. I can put take a photo of it and put it on the kick chat and you guys can do whatever you want from there yeah, with what's it. Yeah, make kit? sure make sure you give it to me. Um, make sure that it's given. Yeah. I don't currently have my phone on me right now. Okay. After this, I'll go grab my phone and I'll message it to you guys. I'll just message uh, you my so, ticker. Uh, brilliant. So, uh, vis uh, visibility check must be turned off for every raid. Starting weapons must be standard assault rifle and magnum with unlimited... Uh, no, sorry, standard, you know, ammo. So, just whatever it is without, you know, changing anything. Um, yeah. Two frag grenades. Um... Radar turned off for every map. Score is turned off and timer is turned off unless we are going to agree on the time beforehand. And standard map uh, mags, yeah, yeah, that, so you guys got that. Invites to members that are in the coalition if a spot is open in a raid. Let's add that in. Sounds good. In a raid. All right, great. So that is the fourth section done. All right. Now, do we want to have like kind of a rule how our members would talk to one another? So like kind of no trash talking and you know kind of that stuff out I of the mean, way. I don't think trash talking is going to be something that inevitably happens because one side's going to get like salty over something and be, try to call bullshit. That's true. So, I, honest, just I at the end of the day, just remind them that it's just for activity. Don't get all salty and super pissed about it. But yeah. they're saying it because exactly. they're mad right now. Just, you drop it and it goes away. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's fine. And so also, we so we won't count that as a rule. We'll just leave that out as common knowledge. Um... All right. So, did anyone else want to add any rules to the tale? Or... No. No, not really. Nope. <laughs> Shadow, are you there? Yeah, I just said no. All right. So, I'll go over all the rules then, and uh, make sure that everyone agrees with them. And I'll put a picture of. Them. On again, I suppose you guys can broadcast them to the community, do whatever you want. Um, so basically, uh, we got the number one section here uh, no gorse hog, no rocket hogs, no rocket vehicles, only two turret hogs, only three mongooses, one scorpion, and one wasp. Applies to attackers and defenders. No wreck weapons. One rocket launcher, one Spartan laser, one railgun, three battle rifles, three DMRs, unlimited magnums, unlimited assault rifle. Well, you know what, we actually take that out now, considering that it's just ammo that's already in the gun. Um, four submachine guns, one hydra, one saw, two shotguns, and those are the only weapons permitted. All doors must be able to be opened from both sides. No team-based raids. Oh. All teleporters must not lead to an ultimate death or a one-way trip. No traps allowed. You must use weather effects that permit you to see 100, 100 feet 
in front or more. Uh, no bridges that require you to walk more than two seconds over it and no strobe lights. <laughs> um, visibility check must be turned off for every raid. Uh, starting weapons must be standard assault rifle and magnum. Uh, radar must be turned off for every map. Score is turned off and timer is turned off. Uh, unless we're grounded time beforehand and standard mag size, mag sizes I should say. Invites to members that are in the raid in the coalition if a spot is open in the raid. Everyone agree? Yep. Yeah. What about Halo 2 BRs? Sure. No, 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 just nothing. No, no, no just, just forget about standard. them. Yeah. For now, at least. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. So that's so, it. All right. Yeah. I'd uh, say so. Unless anyone has anything else, I mean, that I mean, sounds pretty solid. Discuss the raid dates. Now we've got everything out the mm -hmm. way. I thought those are the schedule. I think. Whenever. Yeah. I, I think guess we should be, schedule. Well, should there be like a certain time for everyone yeah. to prepare? I think because we don't have that many yes. maps. At the moment, they're they're in yeah. production right now. So well, I'd well, say we get, just... uh, get yourself at least a, maybe three or four more maps pumped out, and then set up. A, we can start setting stuff up. That way, we can go and alter our bases to regulation. So, do you want to set good. a date for that, yeah. or just yeah. until we've done that? I can just mm. be when you guys are ready. Okay. Yeah, that'd be nice of you. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. We all know Rapture ain't gonna be doing anything anytime soon, so. I'm just gonna sit here and torment a few clans, i.e. Dark Noble. Sounds oh, fine, Dark Noble. Yeah. Okay, oh, so we're done. Uh, then... Wait a minute. Oh yeah, so I'll just uh, keep drawing fun. fifth fleet scams. Stop pissing fifth fleet off, please. No, but uh, Fame, I'm gonna send you the uh, what what started it all. Her like having a tism. And. What the dude? Uh, no. The uh, so you can end the game also. Yeah, you can end the game. Okay, uh, I sent you my kick. Uh, what is your name? Commando.